Okay, just to review, uh, we're going to initiate go-around mode by pressing the go-around button. Once the power comes up, Auto Feather will be armed. We're going to shut down the left engine with the fishing lever. I agree. You ready? Yes, sir. Go around. It's engaged. Oh, wait till the power okay. stabilized. Oh, left, turn it off. Fish lever. Yep. Cut off. Okay, we'll confirm. Front feather. Front feather. It's expected. Go left, lead off now. Left engine. All right, so when we did that, the auto throttle automatically went into an engine out mode. Again, currently it's limiting to ITT to protect the engine to max limits. If we were a colder day, it would be a torque limit, but it's enunciating as such. Right now, we're above minimum control airspeed, 103 knots. We'll start, start a slow deceleration. And as we decelerate through approximately 94 knots, AFM, minimum control speed, the display will switch over into BMCA uh, engine out mode protection. So there it's transitioning. At that time, you'll notice the right throttle is moving back, as is the right engine power indications. So now I am 10 knots below minimum control speed. Your plane is doing just fine. The right throttle has automatically come back through 70% power there. Since I shouldn't be here in the first place, I've now realized my error. I'm lowering the nose to accelerate. And when I get back above VMC speed, the power automatically starts coming forward to give me best possible performance and climb rate for the conditions. Now this next demonstration you'll see that uh, the system is capable of providing a power reduction uh, to allow for excursions as slow as uh, stall warning on the airplane. So I'm going to go ahead and decelerate the airplane back towards stall warning. through VMCA. Right throttle is coming back automatically. So it's providing maximum available power for the airspeed, which is significantly below VMC at this point in time. There's a stall horn. And now using normal stall recovery techniques of just lowering the nose and allowing the airplane to reduce the angle of attack and fly out of the stall, throttle automatically returns to a max power setting. 